to footballgameplan.com where football makes sense. I'm Emory Hunt, the czar of the playbook, breaking down Maine versus Appalachian State presented by anygivensaturday.com. Let's start with the Black Bears in this playoff matchup. Look at the defense side of the football. They have a tough task in guarding quick, the talented wide receiver for Appalachian State. They have to get exotic with those coverages. What I would do is probably put a safety at the line of scrimmage over quick to get him to get off bump press and have your coverage corners behind him to take him away. Only on his side though. Don't do that to the whole D, to the whole offense. Just on his side, put a safety at the line, get the bump on him, have him run toward the corner where they can have uh, that advantage. And look at the running back, Pushon Brown. He's gonna have to have a huge day on screen passes. Give that aggressive defense of Appalachian State something else to worry about. Now you look at the Mountaineers in this ball game. Winning on first down puts a lot of pressure on the Black Bears offense. They're a team that want to operate off balance. They want to run the football and operate off play action. Winning on first down defensively puts a lot of pressure on that offense and the Black Bears live and die by the uh, big play passing. So if you can take that element away and force them to dink and dunk their way down the field, that puts them at another disadvantage. And I think that's where the Mountaineers can win this ball game, which is why I'm going with Appalachian State. I think they come in and dictate how Maine should play, and that's something that Maine hasn't been used to. And I think the Mountaineers win this one at home. For more FCS coverage, visit anygivensaturday.com or visit our YouTube channel at youtube.com slash football game plan. And listen to the Football Game Plan Radio Show, which airs Saturdays, 11 a.m. Eastern Time at blogtalkradio.com slash football game plan.